Hey YouTube, what's going on? This is Nate here, and in this video I'm going to be doing a demo of the Windows 8 Developer Preview that Microsoft made available about a week and a half ago. So if you want to get your hands on this, I will provide a link in the description to this webpage, and you'll be able to download it directly from here. So if you're just the everyday user like me, you're either going to want to get the 32-bit or the 64-bit versions. If you get the one with the developer tools and you're not a developer, you're going to be downloading more than you have to. So once you've got it downloaded, you can go ahead and install it. I'm currently running it in a Parallels virtual machine, so let's go ahead and open it up. And I'm just going to demo some of these Metro style apps for you. So this first one we have here, sorry about that, the scrolling is a bit messed up with my magic mouse. So the first one we have here is the Internet Explorer. Uh, so here you can just type in an address at the bottom, so this is your address bar, we can type in anything we want and it brings it up for you. If you want to refresh the page, you can select this icon. This will bring you back to the previous page, and then, you, of course, you can go forward as well. And if you want to, you can bookmark the web page and bring it to the Start menu. You can also change the, uh, the view of Internet Explorer. Let's go head back to the Start menu then. The next one we have is the Store. So since this is only a developer preview, the Store is not open, but this is where you'll be able to get your Metro-style apps for Windows 8. Next, we have Stocks. And here you'll be able to take a look at how the different indexes are doing for the day. And there's also different news for these indexes as well. Selecting any of these articles will bring them up in the Internet Explorer. And here is the Windows Explorer. So this is going to bring us into the Windows Desktop interface. So here it is here. And it looks pretty similar to the way Windows 7 does everything, uh, with the exception of this ribbon here. So uh, Microsoft first introduced the ribbons with Microsoft Office 2007. Now they're bringing it to Windows Explorer as well. Next we have the control panel. So in here you'll be able to edit all the settings to your liking. It's pretty much the same settings as what you had with Windows 7. It's just a new interface for Windows 8, so I'm not going to go ahead and go through all of them. Next we have headlines. So here you'll be able to enter in a web page and you'll be able to get the latest news. So I have the Boy Genius Report website set up with this. You can select any of these articles here to read more information. Next we have the desktop. So this will bring us back into what we were just in with the Windows Explorer. And next we have uh, Tweetorama and Socialite. So if Socialite, Socialite will uh, work with Facebook and Tweetorama, of course, will work with Twitter. Uh, they're both very nice uh, social networking applications. So here we have weather, and you can take a look at the forecast for the week, and you've also got some nice information up here as well. And for the most part, everything else here is just games or some sort of other application um, that Microsoft has just added to this developer preview. So this has just uh, been a real quick look at the Windows 8 developer preview. I really like it. I really like the interface. I think it looks sleek and nice and how it is integrated with the usual uh, Windows desktop interface. So leave a comment below and let me know what you think about this. And I would encourage you guys to install this on your computer uh, as well. So thanks for taking the time to watch this and I'll see you guys in the next one.